The importance of non-reaction. I had been working with a woman for a while, and I just the other night, I actually got a text from her. And she's done a tremendous job. She's greatly improved the relationship on her own just by doing the things that I had been suggesting and that we've been working on. And the relationship had really come around to a beautiful place. And this was their date night. She had texted me on their date night because her husband had been on the phone for a chunk of the time of their date night. Everything inside of her wanted to react. She was feeling hurt, she was feeling angry, and everything inside of her just wanted to let him have it and react. But she texted me instead. Good for her. So what I said is, while he's on the phone for the remainder of the time, entertain yourself. Do you have a game on your phone? Do you have at something, if they were home, do you have something at home you can go do and just involve yourself in something that's interesting to you? That was the first step. And then I said, when he hangs up the phone, I want you to lovingly smile at him. You can even be affectionate and touch him. And say something supportive about that you know that this is a new job and that this is really important and this is hard. Um, and just so he knows that you support him in that. And then it is okay to request something that you need. I just need a hug. I just need a kiss from you right now. You can even say, I need reassurance that you'll still take time for me, even with your new job. Because if she had just reacted when he got off the phone, it would have ruined the rest of the night. So here's the thing to remember. Even when everything inside of you wants to react, stop and don't do it. Take care of yourself first, then you can address the situation. Don't react. <laughs>